welcome back to another weekly vlog it's sunday and um i'm gonna show you guys what i got i did other people call it instacart but i call it it's i signed up for walmart plus uh, on black friday so i got 90 days for free to see if i like it so i always every week i always place an order um to walmart because i'm always ordering stuff and i but i go pick it up however this time i did i'm sorry i'm that close i did the um Walmart delivery because it was free. It's free as a Walmart Plus. So I went ahead and um, ordered some stuff last night. I, on Sundays, I usually make the list of what I'm gonna cook for the week. Um, I don't have my phone, but I have a list of everything I'm gonna cook. I have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And then I try to order everything that I need for that week on Sunday and I go pick it up in the afternoons. However, today, it got all delivered here to me today. So I'm going to show you guys what I got real quick. So it's my first time trying this. This is a creamy lobster bisque. It's cold outside. So this is my lunch probably for tomorrow. I got some salmon. Some people say salmon. I say salmon. I, to me, it ain't, it ain't salmon. So it's salmon. Salmon. I got some salmon. Uh, I want to do the, the, what do you call that? On TikTok, the, um, Salmon and rice bowls. So I'm gonna try that with the seaweed. I got some chicken, chicken thighs and pico for some chipotle bowls with the cilantro lime rice. I got some fruit, some bananas, lemons and limes for the chipotle bowls. Um, I got some tortillas because we're having tacos Tuesday and some cheese, blueberries, shrimp for the pasta today. Um, I'm making some crawfish and shrimp fettuccine. And I got the Velveeta Fettuccine. This I did not order, but however it came in my thing, I'm gonna just donate this to the daycare. Somebody can use it. This is for the kids for their lunch. This is for the Chipotle bowls. This is for the Chipotle bowls. Mommy. Potatoes for the roasted potatoes on Monday. We did roasted potatoes and chicken wings. So that's for that. Um, wing sauce, because my boys like hot, spicy stuff. I'm making some my homemade honey barbecue sauce. So I needed some more ketchup. I needed some more liquid smoke to make it. Pineapples for my fruit bowl. This is for the kids. They love macaroni and cheese and stuff that's easy for them for their lunches that I packed for them for the girls. So that's that. Half and half is for the fettuccine. Ground meat for the tacos. And then we needed some more of this. I make Zoe's um, food from scratch. Like I, like I home make her food. So um, I use this boil in the bag rice. And then I got them some Jello. So I have this for next time I make her food. We made it yesterday and it came out to make eight bags. Let me show you guys what it looked like. All right, so here's Zoe's food that we made um, yesterday. We make eight bags like this. Like this is this has salmon in it. This has tuna, um, chicken and gizzards. And it has brown rice, vegetables, sweet potatoes, squash, um, spinach, kale, turkey. So I make this, it'll probably last us the rest of this year. So yeah. So yeah, I'm about to go and make this crawfish and shrimp fettuccine for our lunch and then cook again tonight the chipotle bowls. I'm about to marinate the chicken for that, the chicken thighs for that, and that's gonna be our Sunday. Hey y'all, so I am, it's Monday, and I'm actually about to, uh, I'm making a salmon bowl. Y'all been seeing those those um, videos on TikTok where they do the, um, the salmon, the Salmon, rice, sriracha, and the seaweed. I've been wanting to try that. I love sushi, so when I saw that, I was like, ooh, I'm gonna have to try that. But before I did that, I wanna show you guys, I got a comment about my nails in my last video, and I told her that I got them from Amazon. So y'all know I rock press-ons, right? I don't, I rock press-ons. And so I brought this kit from Amazon, and it came with like five different colors. Of nails in like this little bag and you literally just put them on it took me like five minutes to do this I put them on hey, <laughs> I put them on and then I use this nail glue nail bond I'm right here is it gonna focus on this I use that for my nails and it lasts about a week um probably four or five days and that's what I use to do my my nails and I stay on 
pretty good. So um, I will try to link them down below in the description box so you guys can get you some. But I'm about to go ahead and finish making the salmon bowl so I can eat. Y'all, I almost forgot to tell y'all how good this bowl was. Y'all, they, they, they have bread here. This is what I have left. Don't I have that pepper? It's cold. That pepper zero. Um, this, is look, this is what it looks like, what I have left. It's basically, I just grilled some salmon in a cast iron skillet, white rice. Yeah. White rice and then, and then sriracha mayo on top, and then you eat it with seaweed. But I'm scared. I'll let Andre have the rest of the seaweed. So good, so good. Andre, is it good? Yes, ma'am. Mike, you like it? It was good. Caught me off guard. But Delicious. Good. Delicious. He don't like salmon. <clears throat> I like it a lot. So I'm. I ran out of seaweed. I only brought one little pack. So. I would definitely make this again. It was done in letter, literally 10 minutes. It's a 10 minute meal. So. This is on Monday. The kids are eating, I don't know what they're eating. Pizza out the freezer, and I don't know what I'm gonna eat. Eat, eat. my own tonight. Pizza. They're eating pizza, frozen pizza. So, I'm gonna finish eating the rest of this. So good, y'all. Drink my soda. Mm, so good. That's my Monday. I'm so disappointed. I told you guys I ordered some lampshades to match my bedroom. That's the lampshade, y'all. This itty bitty lampshade. Like, I guess it's my fault. I should have looked at the sizes. But you know, like on the actual website, it be looking like it's big. And when it comes in, it's not. So, I am back to square one with these lampshades. And this is what I have versus how big this is, how small that is. So... Being that I don't, uh, I don't know what to do. I'm gonna go. I'm for sure. I'm for sure returning these, but I don't know if I'm gonna find some that's big enough. So I might just skip out on the lampshades this year and just keep what I have and just call it a day. Lampshades did not work out. Abort mission. Y'all. Right, so Mala and Malia, tell them who came to our house. Fred arrived I, mysteriously out of nowhere. The doorbell rang and then Fred came in the house. So now we have Fred and we're gonna read Fred, we're gonna read the book of the elf on the shelf to Mala and Malia. They already know that they cannot touch Fred because if they touch Fred, he loses his power, right? right. So we're gonna read this book to the girls tonight and it's gonna be our little family night. Elf on the shelf. A Christmas tradition. My Rick. Yes, that's Fred. New day. So today um, is um, Wednesday. The girls had ornaments that were due yesterday and they have not been done. So I was the bad parent who did not have want to turn in for my kids. So I'm going to be doing their ornaments. I had to take them on the tree so the girls wouldn't break them. I want to be doing their ornaments. We are going to be doing that. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm all in my face. We are going to be doing their ornaments tonight. Um, have a really bad headache. Don't feel that well. But, but does it matter? No, because I'm a mom. My job doesn't stop. I have to do everything from hell or high water. Has to get done. So what I did was I looked on Pinterest and found some different things to do. And I went to Michael's and it didn't have what I wanted. Let me look at my phone. I'm gonna show you what I wanted to do. Hold on one second. So I really, really, really wanted to do this. This one for them. Um, but I couldn't find the Jingle Bells anywhere. I, well, let me say, I went to Michael's and our Hobby Lobby here is closed. So I couldn't find the Jingle, be Jingle Bells to put around this, but that would have been so cute for one of them. But since I couldn't find it, I have to settle with um, doing this one from Pinterest. Did I save it? Did I, I didn't save it. Oh my gosh. 
Let me see. I'm gonna find it real quick and show y'all. It's it's pretty simple. It's basically like one of these little glitter ornaments. You just fill it up with like Mod Podge or glue. I'm gonna use Mod Podge. And then like you pour out the excess and then you just dump glitter in it and like spread it all around. Call it a day. That's gonna be their that's gonna be their ornament inside this one, which is very small. I thought it was bigger than that. But I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna do it in a rainbow. A rainbow. So and I brought them some initials that won't fit on it because I thought the ornaments were bigger than this. But I had brought these this M to go on to it. But it's it's not gonna fit. But I also bought these little rainbow things to go around it to make it like a rainbow um, ornament with the pink and yellow glitter. So I'm gonna do one pink, one yellow. And I brought a G, but again, I thought it was bigger than this. So this ain't gonna work. So I'm gonna just try to, it's gonna be a basic ornament, y'all. I'm usually kind of competitive when it comes down to my kids and like making sure like they have like, try to have the best of whatever or do the best, but today, because it's our this this project is already past due, we gonna just go ahead and just do the um, basic glitter with a rainbow. Then you can have a rainbow, a green one and a yellow rainbow. Call it a day. Dashing through the snow in a one horse open sleigh, or the fields we go, laughing all the way. Bells on bobtail ring, making spirits bright. leave this like this it's gonna be a little marbleized I guess ornament it's not what it's supposed to be Mom. but we're gonna roll with that and y'all look Fred is go. in there well, where was Fred at today where was Fred at today tell them tell them what where you found Fred at today in my room yeah y'all but Fred flew in her room and he was on the shelf he was the elf on the shelf. Right. Thursday. So, I actually got home and I told the kids to just like start putting all of the boxes that we get in, just put them in the spare room, just put them in the spare room, put them in the spare room. Y'all. This is the spare room. Boxes high on the floor. Even stuff behind here with packages. Having to come home to realize how much I have to wrap is a little bit overwhelming. So the other night, Micah started wrapping a lot of the gifts, which is gonna, which has helped me. However, that was before I started Black Friday shopping. I told you on the last vlog that like I spent way too much money at Kohl's. So probably 50% of these boxes is Kohl's, and which is mainly gifts. Some things for the girls. The girls needed some more uh, boots and stuff. So I've ordered them some um, some some boots. We're taking pictures Saturday, y'all. And I'm literally debating on if I should just redo Malia hair and keep it like it is. Like I have like in all those little individual plaits and reflat iron Mala's hair. But me do it. I wanted to send her to a girl here, but she's booked. And the other lady who I was going to use, she's all the way in Iowa. And I don't get out till 5 o'clock. I mean, 4.30, so I didn't want to have to drive all the way to Iowa. So I'm just kind of like, so I'm about to be just save my little coins and do it myself. And I want to do it because Mala cries every time I do her hair. But I want to show you guys real quick what I'm, what, real quick what, what we're wearing for our family pictures. I really wish my bonus kids could be able to be in it, but they don't live here anymore. So they can't be in the pictures. So it's going to be just us. Um in the pictures but we're wearing plaid so i ordered all of our shirts and clothes from shein and it's like we're all wearing different color plaid so like this is one shirt this is smile or malia's one of theirs and like the sleeves are different from the the side you know it's different plaid so we're gonna all wear colorful plaid for our pictures so i'm so excited you guys that will be included in this my package is falling over. That will be included in this uh, vlog because that's Saturday. Today's Thursday. So tomorrow will be a hair day. Doing hair. My hair, their hair, all of that. Tonight, um, we're supposed to go out to eat. Like a little date night. So, Michael's working out. 
right now so I guess I'll just go ahead and uh, keep my makeup on for that tonight and that'll be my Thursday so signing out you guys it's Friday did not vlog today y'all I've been non-stop since I got off of work I came home washed my hair did Mala hair did Malia's hair trimmed Mala hair flat ironed her hair and it looks like all I did was blow dry her hair was still a hot poof mess so I'm not good with straight hair. I'm just stick. I'm gonna stick with curls and call it a day. Cause I use my my uh, my cheap flat iron, but this is like I've had this like literally since college. So it's been over 10 years, and I guess it's time for a new flat iron. I don't know. It just didn't work. Her hair is poofy. I just put it up and told him we'll get in bed. So we got pictures in the morning. I'm going to Houston after that, and that's gonna be our Saturday. Sorry, this vlog is pretty boring. Really hadn't had a lot going on this week, but I still said that regardless, I want to show you guys what I've done every day. So that's what I promised to do, and that's what I'm going to still do. Stop rambling. It's time to go to bed. It's like 10.30. Yeah, 10.40 actually. Mike is doing laundry, putting the girls' clothes to bed. I twisted his hair last night. I'm going to show y'all his hair. He got a little cut, and he think he's something. Look. Really? Look. He think he's something. I did some little, um, what do we call this? Dookie, dookie twists. What do you call that? Two strand twists. Two strand twists. I did them chunky because I did not want to do it. I didn't want to do no hair, but he begged me and begged me and begged me and I just finally gave me in. So that's his little twist, twisty, twisty do. I need to get all of this organized and under control. I used to coupon and, I, and like this was all my stockpile, but I don't have a coupon anymore. So now it's just a whole bunch of junk. So excuse this and focus on this hair. Good night. Good night. No, tell the people good night. Well, you had your hand up, so I thought you. Were I was trying to block something. Say good night. About to, we loading up the car to go ahead and head out. The kids are dressed and ready. Thank you. The kids are in my purse. We got Zoe. Even Zoe has a little plaid on. Hi, Zozo. Hi, Zozo. So, everybody, my shirt is in the back because it's long sleeve and it's like 70 degrees out here, which is normal for Louisiana. So, we're about to head to. Orange, which is you see this lighting, which is 20 minutes from here. Wait, I'm in the garage, so that's why it's like really bad lighting. But I'm gonna show you guys. Hopefully, our outfits. While we're taking them, if I can set the camera somewhere to uh, show up. I got my hair still banded, so I'm gonna see how this comes out. I did it in multiple. I usually just band like literally two, but I did it like several ones. Y'all saw earlier, so I'm gonna see how that works. In my hair, if it gets more volume, how it looks, so we'll see how that goes. I'm so sorry for the footage, so I'm going to end this right here. So, I did not get to do my nails last night, so I'm putting them on right now. I'm doing these little press-on uh, nails in the car, and I like these a lot. These are the Kiss brand, I think. 
Yeah. These kids brand, the real short ones, but they have like the numbers labeled at the top so you can match your nails to the other side. So it's just a French manicure and I'm about to do this hand in the car. It's just kind of hard trying to get this done while he's driving crazy. So I'm going to go ahead and do the rest of this. I'm going to go ahead and do, the, do my other hand. What up, what up, everybody? We made it to H Town, Houston. Um, my nephew's birthday party is tonight. I mean, it's today at five o'clock. I don't know. I don't know where he at. Jaden is somewhere else. It's one fifty. One fifty. So um, he hurt. He's in the middle of the game. Middle of the game. This one here was on the game. Heard me. Talking to my camera and okay, running downstairs. You wanna be on the vlog, DJ? You wanna be on the vlog? Sure. Tell him hi. Hi. So uh, that's tonight at five. So we're about to actually do nothing. It's almost two o'clock and kind of gloomy outside. Wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We wish. 